What's up guys, you watch another video. Very early today, seven in the morning. Keep in mind I stopped editing at like 3 a.m. today. <laughs> I'm super freaking tired, but we got a very busy day today. We're in the G80 right now because we gotta go pick up some new tires for that car, the F80. And as you guys know, that car has a roll cage and it's impractical now. <laughs> can't fold the seats down, so I can't really put tires in that car. And those seats are white, and I don't really want to mess them up. Luckily, the G80 seats fold down, and you can put a lot of stuff back here. You can put four tires and wheels. Before we go, I got to show you guys how bald the tires are on the F80. This honestly is why I haven't driven this car. Because I haven't driven this car in a long time, guys. I know you guys probably missed the F80 CS on the channel, and I do too. But after today, after we put some new tires on it, we're going to start driving this more, because I do miss this car. I know we've been showing a lot of love to the G80 recently, because we got the new two and all that good stuff but bro can't go wrong with the cs i love this freaking car but check out the tires guys share the fronts look how bald these tires are and they look like they're pretty old i bought the tires and wheels together so i think the previous owner used to like track the car or something like that i don't know but look at the rears they're even worse so yeah, it's like not terrible, but I definitely need some tires. And it's low-key starting to rain in LA now, so it's starting to get a little sketchy. But these definitely look old, bro. Like, they're all slippery. Today, we're gonna get some new tires. Shout out to my boy at Tire Bullies. I'll leave you the Instagram right here. My boy, David, he's literally the tire plug. I've been telling you guys this forever. He actually helped me get tires for that car, which we're gonna need new tires for that soon. <laughs> he's the tire plug. If you guys want the best prices for tires, Tire Bullies, guys. Let him know I sent you, find Enix sent you. We're gonna go to the warehouse right now, pick up some tires for this car, rush back home, hopefully get to mount it today too, and then start driving this car more. Now we can take it to the canyon as well, because I want to take this thing to the canyon. It's just very sketchy. Like, they are pretty bald, guys. I know a lot of people will be like, you can drive on it like that, but hell no, those shits are slippery, bro. And then we gotta rush back. I gotta get a haircut today, um, mount the tires onto that car. Then I think we might go meet up with Kevin and Garrett. And we might be putting, um, I think today me and Garrett might switch wheels. His E92 with the E88s and then my TE37s. So we're gonna swap the wheels just for a video, see how they look. I've always wanted BBS E88, so it'll be cool to see. All right, guys, tires acquired. We got the four tires in here, 275. 35 18s for the F80. Specs I was running on my last F82 with the T37. So my bad, I got a cough drop in my mouth. I'm finally feeling a little better today, guys. I'm not coughing as much, thank God. Your boy's been sick these past couple days. My energy has been low. I feel like you can see it through the vlogs. I'm just sick, bro. <laughs> I'm finally feeling better. Finally feeling a little bit like myself again. I always get sick, dude. I don't know what's wrong with me. I gotta eat better, huh? Yeah, see, I be eating horrible in the vlogs, dude. I stopped going to the gym too. Remember I got on like this little gym grind for a little bit? I told you guys I was gonna vlog it. I told you guys to push me to go to the gym and don't let me slack. And here I am slacking, bro. I haven't been to the gym in like, by a month, bro, since those videos. Anyways, I'm feeling better today, finally. But we got the tires. Now let's go back home, probably get a haircut first and then mount the tires on the F80, hopefully. As you guys can see, we got the four tires in here. We went with Kenda. Uh, KA20 or something like that. I don't know. Honestly, it'll do the job. I know Sam actually runs these tires on his drift cars, and Sam loves them. I think he's sponsored by them as well. If Sam runs them on the drift car, we can run them on the F80. F80 is like a little drift car too. <laughs> but like I said before, if you guys need any tires, make sure you guys hit up my boy Tire Bullies. He's literally a tire plug, bro. I tell everybody, I tell all my friends, I tell you guys, he's the only place to go to if you need tires. Yeah, look at those, bro. Ready to do some drifting. <laughs> and soon we're gonna need some freaking tires for this car. But now I'm running Nitto G2s on this car. They're cool, but not like when you're trying to make this much power. I was thinking of just getting the same tire size that I have on this car already, but the Nitto R2s, more of like a drag radial compound. But honestly, I'm thinking of downsizing. These are 19s right now. I'm thinking of downsizing to an 18 inch wheel in the back and then running like an even bigger tire than a 305, maybe like three. 25 or something or 315 with an 18 inch wheel in the back the gd will look mean like that but but we'll see i don't know i don't know yet but we definitely got to get new tires for this car as well too money 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 bro <laughs> i'm telling you guys it's really not that easy building two cars at once but you gotta buy mods times two you need new tires now you need eight new tires bro i needed tires for the f80 I also need to get coilovers for that car because that car is still not slammed. It's on springs right now from the previous owner, but I want to slam it like my last F80. So we need coilovers for that car. It's more money. <laughs> and I still want to powder coat those wheels a new color. JD needs new tires and maybe a new wheel set up in the back. It's never ending, bro. <laughs> That's what I get for wanting to have multiple cars on. The crazy part is, guys, is like if you really like 
do the math and you see all my cars, the GTR, the G80 M3, and the F80 M3 CS, we realistically could be driving like a supercar Lamborghini right now. Like, easily, bro. I sold all the cars and just got one supercar or one Lamborghini, maybe even a McLaren or something. Like, I easily could get a supercar. But you guys tell me, comment down below. I wanna see everybody in the comments right now. Would you guys rather have my lineup of cars, a G80 M3, F80 M3 CS, and a GTR, or just like one Huracan. What would you rather have? I know some people might rather have just a Lambo, you know, like every kid's dream is to have a Lamborghini. Mine too, bro, you guys know that. I literally could have a Lambo right now. <laughs> but instead I got three freaking crazy cars. And I still have the E46, bro. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I need to give you guys a freaking update on that car. But still, like I literally could be driving a Lamborghini right now, bro. Honestly, any supercar. But what would you guys rather have? It's a hard decision, I'm not gonna lie. Like it's cool having these BMWs, but it's also cool having a freaking Lambo. Imagine pulling up in a Lambo everywhere. I don't know. <laughs> Woo. Woo, oh my god. Bro, this car is so fast. Crazy these downshifts though. Bro, oh, it's gonna be so loud. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> this tune is actually crazy. You wanna know something even crazier? That they said that they can make the pops even louder than this, bro. Like, it's not even done yet. Supposedly, we can make the pops louder. <laughs> There's no way, bro. You just wanna know what else I found out? This thing has rolling anti lag. <laughs> Just like the GTR, I'm gonna show you guys after I get this haircut, all right? It's scary. I don't know how I'm gonna film it and do it because, bro, it builds all the boost up. As soon as I let go of this freaking little switch, it just goes. It's rolling anti lag, literally just like the GTR. Made it to the tire shop. We're actually gonna leave the tires here right now and then go swap cars. Because, like I said, they do not fit in the CS. And hopefully, my tires are still here. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> Hopefully my tires are still here when we get back, bro. For now, let's go get the CS. Bro, this clutch is a freaking leg workout, bro. <laughs> what is that, brother? Hop it in the CS now. We can go M for M, bro. This car's gonna be so loud. I need to fix this exhaust too, guys. That's another reason why I haven't really driven it. Because it's so loud, like super freaking loud and obnoxious and I I can't really shut it up. I broke the exhaust valve, if you remember. Shot flames, I must have broke the valve completely and now it doesn't close, it's full open now. Which is cool, it sounds good, it just, bro, driving around LA with a fully straight piped car pretty much, pretty freaking loud and then the tune doesn't help either watch <laughs> bro <laughs> I forget how loud this car is so sick though with the cage and everything I forget I'm telling you I said this in this video maybe last video that it's so hard to drive three different cars and build them all and enjoy them all. Like, I started driving the G80 for a week, and then I forget about this car. I forget how sick the CS is. Then I'll start driving this car, and I'll forget the freaking G80 is sick. And you guys see the GTR. That shit just neglected, bro. It's so sad. But then I got into that car the other day, just drove it around the block, got the E85 running through it, and I forgot how sick that car was, bro. Like, it's hard to really enjoy all three cars at once. Look how bad these tires are, watch. Dude, we need to turn these burbles off. <laughs> Guys, look at the before. Oh my god, these are bald, dude. Like, I probably could still drive on them, but hell no, nah, those shoes are not safe. 275, 35, 18. Same setup I had on my F80. Same wheel specs and same tire specs. Now, all we gotta do is just dial in the fitment, bro. Get coilovers, like I said, so we can slam it more, fill in this little gap. I want it like right. Right there, drop it like an inch in the front and the back. Maybe add the camera plates in the front too, like my last car. Make it look sick. Damn, look who decided to pull up, guys. 
Literally just said to hi. Literally came to just say hi and then leave. That's it. He's already leaving, bro. But the M face is getting the tire swapped right now. We might meet up with Kevin after this. Why haven't I seen the M4? We've been driving it's this Halloween shit. Fun. Huh? It's Halloween fun. Who said Halloween? Big old pumpkin. For years I've been telling Kevin to freaking wrap the hood like a jack-o'-lantern, like the little triangle face and the mouth. You gotta do it, bro. Or on the doors, it'll be sick too. I'm gonna do it. No, you're not, bro. He said, I'm gonna do everything. I'm gonna buy tees, I'm gonna buy ED8s, I'm gonna buy a roll cage, I'm gonna do this and that. I buy G80. Do a burnout, G. Come on! No plates, no case. Damn. It looks like a little hovercraft right now. It is crazy I have an M3 CS on. Like, it's not no regular F80, guys. It's a freaking CS. I think I forget sometimes. Guys, we're done. This is our hella meaty, huh? Ready to do some donuts. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> we need some tire shine on here, bro. This shit looking rough, but we got new tires, guys. Which is good. Now we can hit the canyon, bro. I've been wanting to take this car to the canyon, guys. I haven't taken it. It's a CS. You got the roll cage. You got everything. <laughs> <laughs> bro, this car is insane, bro. Oh shoot, M2! I want one of those two now! <laughs> I was saying I'll never be able to pick between the F80 and the G80. I can't, bro. They're both freaking sick. This thing is nice, all black. That's clean. You know what else I forgot? On the list of things I gotta do to my cars, I still gotta do the crank hub on this car. I have not done the crank up, bro. <laughs> Alright, we made it to Daniel's. Bro, it's so windy. <laughs> I was just telling Kevin right now that my car is so lifted, bro. I don't need to order. I think I need to order the coilovers now, dude. Because there's no way I'm going to be driving like this, bro. Way too lifted. Bad, bro, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I need to slam it. And I need to change the wheel color. I'm over the color already. I'm changing the color for sure. What color? White. I have to match the cage. Daniel? What's up, Nick? Hi, Daniel. How's it going? Good. What are you doing to it? Uh, just put the radar mount. That's sick. Yeah, now it won't fall. It's secure. Oh, that's clean. So it's on the mirror. Oh, so it doesn't stick to the window? No, like no, mine. not no more. Now he's just going to go ahead and have it mount. We can do that in ours? Yeah. That's pretty sick. <laughs> Isn't that crazy how this car has a lift? <laughs> it's actually crazy, guys. So this car has a air lift on the front. Like a freaking Lambo or supercar. No. So you don't break the front lip. I know he actually pulled in like, you know, like good chill. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's no crazy. Problem, no issues. Yeah, like, you don't gotta worry about scraping your lip. I'm telling you, Garrett's car. I showed you guys on. I showed you guys it on the vlog before, but it has everything you could possibly think done to this car. It has the BBSs, it has coilovers, it has camera plays, it has the lip. It's supercharged too, by the way. Look at you see the little air filter that's in there. But supercharged, and even like an airlift. You have more of this. And the full interiors. Uh, Redone. Look at that. Even the door panels. I love this car. Even the floor mats. <laughs> oh, this is redone. Oh, that is redone. Looks good. Damn, this car is sick. They got the full titanium exhaust too. You guys can kind of see it. Yeah, we might, 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 might swap wheels, guys. The BBSs will look so good on that car. Oddly enough, I think the gold and the red will look clean. And those blue tees will look good on here too. These are like my dream wheels, bro. Especially for the F80. They look so good on F80s and E92s. Alright, we're gonna stop Kevin's first. You think gold and orange will look sick? Yes, it looks yeah, sick. Yeah, bro. bro. You think so, Ayers? Yeah. Bro, those wheels are sick, man. Like, These wheels are beautiful. Like yeah, I know, I like the 88s. Bro, that's the cleanest E92 M3 I've ever seen in my life, bro. <laughs> it bro. really is, though, honestly. I swear, man. You'll get the paint, bro. No scratch. For a black car, nothing. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. It's perfect. The paint is in immaculate condition. It's amazing yeah. build. Amazing. Very amazing. Very amazing. Very clean. Yeah. You should trade in your Lime Rock. <laughs> and the Bronco. Yeah. <laughs> I want to feel like I'm back in 2013. <laughs> How's it feeling there? Feels good. Old it makes mold? me feel younger. <laughs> Once I get here, it makes me feel like 10 years younger. <laughs> Brings me back to back in the days. Like being slow. Yeah, being slow. <laughs> and loud. <laughs> slow what and loud. here, man? What? Ew. I'm really holding two cameras, guys. Am I filming now? Look at that. Why do you be not filming? I'm down. Come on, G. I'll do it. Hello. Hugo quit. Let's talk numbers, G. Hugo quit his job. <laughs> he was a filmer for like a week. You want to hire Nick? 
I do. I, I want, he's gonna take over. Kevin, look how trash That's these insane, are, bro. bro. What the Holy fuck? shit. Fire, bro. <laughs> bro, I swear I think after it. <laughs> but this is some like 20, 20 Finding Nick vlogs. We'd be in the driveway, taking off our wheels and stuff. <laughs> we used to do a lot of this, bro. Swapping wheels and jacking up cars in the street. Yo, your rotors are bad, man. <laughs> what you feel it? Everything's bad. You have bad, bad rotors. <laughs> you have a penny? Everything's bad I'll on show you. You have a penny? No. I'll show you. I'll show you how you see, you see bad rotors. Hates your car? <laughs> Ayers hates me. <laughs> Stupid bald f***. <laughs> Bro! <laughs> Bro, the spacer does not come off. Kevin said he hasn't taken the spacer off since he bought the car. Look at it! <laughs> Bending the screwdriver. If it gets stopped, it means the rotor is bad. Ready? Stops. Look. What? <laughs> you have a lip. He has a lip on it. God, everyone's even worse. Let me see. Oh my god. <laughs> Bro, it just got stuck here. You need some for real? He does. Oh shoot, Kevin. I'm gonna do it too. <laughs> bro, I'm gonna do it. it's so I'm gonna expensive. Do it. Bro, I've never changed rotors on any car, you know that? It's like two thousand dollars. Nah. Oh, Both nothing. Rotors and pads, you gotta change the pads in the same time. It's you got like two thousand dollars hoodie on. Tartuga. <laughs> Naranja Tartuga. <laughs> She's gonna look crazy, Kevin. I know. I already know it. If this doesn't convince you. It's not gonna happen, guys. He's never gonna change his wheels. <laughs> E98s look so good on E92s and F80s. I feel like I really like like the track look on the E92s. That's why I really like the E8s. Bro, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Damn, you know, bro. Version two. This with like, the wing and a roll cage, Kevin. Wow. Imagine orange cage. Wow. Uh, backseat okay. delete like the GTS. Wow. Doing all this and still won't buy any. That looks <laughs> He's I'm not gonna do it, it, huh? I'm gonna do it. That's why I said. I said if this doesn't convince him, I don't hey, know what yeah, it is, bro. Make a bet. No, no. Bet? He's gonna bite. I'm biting. I know he's gonna bite. No, he's not. Yeah, bro. No, for real. I swear the orange and gold looks sick. Orange and gold is sick. Orange and gold does. Even the silver face would be stuck. Oh, yeah, yeah, too. Like a brush face. I don't think it's gonna fit because the front is super wide, but. <laughs> yeah, it looks like a. I don't know. Something you see at the track. Yeah. Bro, hey, you should do a poll on YouTube. What do you guys think? Comp wheels or PBS? <laughs> BBS for sure. That's so you know that his original wheels look like shit. <laughs> we, we we challenge this every day. I'm scared to see this shit drop though. I know. Wait, we should, I think the front's gonna hey, hit. Did you record the front? They're already broken though. Yeah. <laughs> I love Eric talking is. shit, bro. Old and mold. <laughs> it might peak in perfect. Look. Oh, my God, looks oh. So wow, dude. Oh, the front fit is nice. <laughs> what do you guys think? <laughs> Kevin, it looks hard, ridiculous, bro. dude. Oh God, that man. looks hard. That looks hard man. If you did that, I, I will never talk about your car <laughs> ever again. Bro, it looks so good. That looks sick. Wow. Wow. With the orange calipers too behind it? Bro, you're going to want to drive this car over the GTS? No. I would. I would. I would. <laughs> no, no, I like it. I like it with the <laughs> No, me too. That's what I said. I was like, we yeah. can't talk anymore. Yeah, I cannot talk anything anymore. Bro, wheels change everything on the United wow. too. And imagine with the cage and the wing, bro. Oh, shit. Bro, it look insane. Look Bro, I'm sorry, guys. I hate these wheels. Wow, it looks sick. <laughs> Bro. All right, while well, Kevin has his little photo shoot over there, <laughs> we're gonna put the TEs onto Garrett's car, which I'm excited to see. I wanna see how this thing's gonna look. And then once Kevin comes over here, we can swap back his stock wheels. <laughs> this is gonna look fire too, honestly. <laughs> I love United 2, the TEs too. I wanna see these wheels on Kevin's car too. We're just gonna switch too many wheels though. <laughs> just Photoshop. If only Kevin has some cooler wheels, we could all swap for a couple weeks and then kept switching in a circle. <laughs> But no one wants them. <laughs> hey, that'll fit your car. Those may be, honestly, but that shit will look ugly. Because <laughs> those are E92 wheels. What if we do half and half? I'm down. If it's possible. Man, that shit looks sick. With the red calipers behind, too. But you guys have a big, big brake kit, bro. This looks insane, <laughs> God. Ooh. This color looks good on the black. Hey, I can run both rims, I guess. But oh, it actually looks so good, though. That's fire. I don't know, bro. Can't go wrong with either. Look at this car. Wow. <laughs> bro, these are sick. His reaction. 
No, honestly, it looks insane, bro. Like, it actually looks crazy. Sheesh. Like, I like it a lot, bro. I think we might rock it. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Wow, that looks insane. We might rock it tomorrow to the meet. If mine fits correctly. All right, you guys ready to see the F80? It looks insane, bro. The back fitment's a little, a little ugly, but the bad coilovers will look way better. <laughs> Check this out. <laughs> bro, e is so good on any car, huh? They looked insane on Kevin's car. They look even crazier on mine, I feel like. Damn, it's just the fit man's kind of iffy, bro. Look at this big old wheel gap. Maybe if I drive it forward and back, maybe it'll settle a little more, but the front is sick. Maybe just add some camber, but damn, it looks crazy, bro. Yeah, the back looks terrible, bro, but I think if I drive it, maybe, I don't know. Damn, that front end looks aggressive, bro. With the CS in it. I need those wheels too. <laughs> we both do. That fade looks insane. I never get to see it drive. I don't know, we might keep it like this for tomorrow's meet, guys. <laughs> There's a car meet tomorrow, we might do it. It's not ideal, like the wheel setups are kind of different. You can tell like his wheels aren't as flush and mine kind of poke out. I think the E88s are more aggressive for sure, but I mean, you could drive on it. Not ideal, but damn, it looks good. Guys, look, we just washed it and oh my god. These wheels look so good. I need to build a set for sure, bro. Like this for sure confirmed it. I would do the gold too, I think. Gold with the red, it's fire. Yeah, we just got it all washed. We got the BBSs on this side and then we got the TEs on this side. Both sides look good. Like honestly, these are my two favorite wheels on the F80. Probably the only two wheels I would put on this car. It looks good either way. Wow. Yeah, I can't get over this. I don't want to give Garrett back his wheels, bro. Before we make up our mind if we're going to rock these wheels tomorrow for the meet, we're going to go for a little test drive, make sure everything's good because the wheels are different. Like I said, the BBSs are more aggressive, so they do stick out a little more, and I want to make sure they don't rub on my car. Same with Garrett's car. We want to make sure. It's probably not ideal to run these either because <laughs> although all the wheels are 18, so it's not like we're going 19s on one side, 18s on the other, they're all 18s, but I think mine... I think the BBSs might be wider. So it's probably not ideal to rock the TEs on one side, BBS on the other, but we might do it for tomorrow's video, just for the car meet that we want to go to. This car looks so good. The 88s on this side, which looks freaking good. You got the TEs on this side. Damn. I really don't know which ones I like better on this car. I'm being honest. I think, I hope. <laughs> the car's driving straight. Does it feel weird? It feels normal, huh? <laughs> it's like how funny. <laughs> Completely different tires, bro. <laughs> See, I don't know, bro. Gary was like, I think my tires are bigger. I forgot what sizes are, but mine are 275. His might be like 285 or something like that. See, I don't think this is ideal to be riding two different lopsided tires but does the car look crooked bro i don't know bro i don't know if we're chilling or not it feels normal like i wouldn't even be able to, i don't even think i'd be able to tell that there's different wheels on the car right now The night we are back home and tomorrow morning we're about to go to this old car meet with two different wheels on the car the te's and bbs e88s on this side i can't wait to get people's reactions tomorrow bro and guys my lips are on fire today was super windy as you guys saw and bro my lips are chapped looks like i got lipstick on anyways let's go upstairs i think i have to open up some packages I'll open that in the vlog and then i'll probably end the vlog right there change of plans guys we got some goodies in the mail for the g80 that 
actually came in the mail today, so let's open them up real quick. Bro, it's always so loud in the parking garage. This big old machine, bro, I don't even know what it is. Anyways, let's unbox this real quick. Sorry about the loud noise, by the way. I don't know if it's gonna fit. I'm gonna be quite honest. I don't think it's made for this car, but I feel like we might be able to make it fit. It could be anything, huh? <laughs> we got a new shift knob for the G80. It has like the M Performance logo on it. It's all carbon fiber and Alcantara. I've always wanted this, even in my F80, but I never ordered it, but I finally did. Hopefully it fits, like I said. I think this is made for an E90 and E46. So is it gonna fit? I don't know, bro. But I couldn't find any G80 one, so I'm assuming it's gonna fit. Now I tried installing one of these once on my F80 and I almost knocked my teeth out, bro, because you gotta like pull the stock one and <laughs> it's not easy. But look at the before and after. It's so much better. Why isn't it focusing? Look at that, M performance, it has all the gears. It's sick, smaller, cleaner, all Alcantara, so it's gonna match like all the here, all the M performance stuff. It's really, really cool. But I think you just pull it up and it comes off. <laughs> oh my God. Ugh. Oh my God, dude. There's no way. Oh, that literally hurt my wrist. Pretty sure you just pull it. Bro, I'm telling you, I just hit my face, dude. Oh! <laughs> you guys see that? Dude. All right, how am I gonna swap this over? It literally almost hit my face. You guys see that? What the? <laughs> I think it is gonna fit. Damn, it's way better too. <laughs> bro, I can't wait to drive the car with this. All right, check it out, guys. Look how clean that is, bro. So much better. Sheesh! I literally might go test drive it right now. This little shift knob is going for like $300 with like the Alcantara thing right here, which I don't even think fits with the GAD. You have to replace it anyways. Honestly, it was super easy. I'm gonna give you guys the hack right now, all right? Any manual guys out there, if you guys want the freaking hack, so I guess it's like a $300 one like this, guys. Um, you can find it online. It comes with like the shift boot. It comes with like the shift knob like this on Alcantara carbon fiber, and then the boot is Alcantara. $300, right? I got this one for like 30 bucks on eBay, guys, and <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this shit is perfect, bro. I'm so glad I did not waste my money on that. That is insane. Look, Alcantara, carbon right here, and it fits perfect. I should have did this a long time ago, even on the F80. I never did it because, bro, 300 bucks for a shift knob is crazy, but it honestly kind of feels like a little short shifter, too. Am I tripping or not? Let me show you the next mod. I'm super hyped for this package, but I don't think we can install it today. This is from our guys over at Golden Wrench Supply. I've made a vlog with them before, if you guys remember. So Golden Wrench actually makes like the engine um, covers for like the coolant, the oil cap, even my gas cap. If you guys have seen all that like in the vlogs, it's like silver right now. But wait till you see what they cooked up for me, bro. We've been talking about this like before beam invasion. This was in the works. Check this out. Sheesh. Oh, all the stickers fell. <laughs> but look, look at the caps, guys. They're all mint green to match the freaking car. This is insane. Check this out, a little coolant cap. I'm gonna take it out the plastic so you guys can see. Sometimes they offer um, color match or any like custom color you wanna do for your caps. They always have like the blue, the red, and the silver in stock all the time. But like I said, sometimes they do like a limited offer of your own custom color. And they made me mint green caps for the engine bay. I think the coolant, right? I'm pretty sure. Dude. <laughs> It literally matches my car. Look at the quality, guys. Like, I'll tap the back so they don't scratch, but like, this is very good quality. But if you guys want to get this, make sure you guys hit up Golden Ranch. Their Instagram is right there, actually. So, there's their Instagram. And go check them out, guys. I'm gonna show you guys the engine bay right now so you guys can get an idea. Bro, I'm telling you, the BMW mods don't end, bro. Like, there's so much you can do to these cars. So much more I could still do. Like, I can do seats, I can do a roll cage in here, I can do star lights if you really want to. We could do big single turbo. We could do the B-lock wheel on the back. I could do the carbon hood, carbon fenders, carbon trunk. Like, bro, it's never gonna end, dude. <laughs> I am so hyped to install these engine covers and I'm so hyped on the shift knob, bro. $30 shift knob, sheesh, you can't beat that, bro. Also, look, this is from Golden Wrench as well. <laughs> in the freaking hood latch. So in the engine bay, we actually have the silver ones, like I said. Engine bay looks sick, bro. We got all the titanium intake 
Brace, the Brace Bars Titanium. It needs a car wash though, look at it. You can't even see the titanium. <laughs> but we got the carbon engine cover, which also needs to be wiped down. But look, these are the silver caps that we have right now. That's silver, that one's silver. And then we got the oil cap right here. That is silver. And then that one right there. But bro, wait till we install this. Like, this is gonna look crazy. It literally matches the car too. Oh my God, it looks so freaking good, bro. Yeah, these are gonna replace that right there. So you guys can get an idea. Imagine with all the Tiffany caps, bro. The titanium, the carbon fiber, bro. The engine bay looks sick. I've never touched my engine bay in most of my cars. Like most of my engine bays are all stock. But this one, bro, we've, been, we've done everything to this car. These came out so good, bro. With the Downstar hardware too. Okay. Titanium up here, titanium hardware over here. This engine bay is ridiculous. <laughs> All we're missing is the big single turbo, look. We have all the room for it right here too, the big single turbo. I love the G80, guys. I love both my cars, like, I'm so blessed, bro. I got like sick ass cars, dude. Literally, guys, like, I'm so freaking blessed. I have the GTR over there as well, like, it's crazy, dude. Sometimes you gotta just like, soak it all in, take it in, bro. Did you forget, dude, your life's moving so fast. I'm just posting videos, posting videos, like, I forget what I'm like. What I have, what I've accomplished, bro. Like, it's kind of crazy, dude. Anyways, shout out to Golden Ranch once again. And shout out to eBay. <laughs> Stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog. It's going to be lit. I cannot wait. All the homies are coming outside. Fresh Kicks, Anthro, Kevin, Garrett, Daniel. Everyone's going to this meet tomorrow. So it should be a cool day. Yeah, we're taking the F80. I wanted to take the G80. I kind of want to take it now that I have to shift now. But it's going to be cool. I can't wait to show off the BBSs. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. I might sip out this bottle until it get hollow Shit, I might sip out this bottle just drowning my sorrows Drowning my sorrows, be better tomorrow Cause these broken dreams is as hard as it gets My nigga died at only 25, I'm thanking God for letting me see in 26, shit